You're watching The 7pm Project and I am a huge fan of our next guest. Most girls and some guys growing up loved Olivia Newton-John. Who can forget those pants we all wanted to wear and the songs that defined a generation? You're the one that I want, some are loving, physical and Xanadu. And one of Olivia's biggest fans, Miff Warhurst, got the chance to sit down and chat with this Aussie legend. Olivia, I have to say it is absolutely wonderful to meet you today. Oh, thank you. Um, very excited, personally, because um, I wanted you to know that this, this is my very first album, oh. bought with my own money. You've still got I've it, still which got I'm it. very, very impressed. <laughs> I know all the words to all of your songs, pretty much. What is it that makes them so timeless, do you think? Like, people still show their children grease. It's a that, rite of passage. Oh, that movie, it's really incredible, isn't it? That yeah. people still love it so much. Um, it is a timeless movie. First of all, it's like a, a period piece. It's set in the 50s and the 50s outfits. I think everyone loves that that look and that time period. It has a real nostalgia to it. And the music is great. The music is timeless. I have to ask, have you still got the black... Pants. I do. Where I'm are wearing they? them. No, here they are. <laughs> no, they're in my wardrobe at home. I would never dare try to put them on. I'm scared they'll just go to dust or something. <laughs> and that's my excuse for not trying them on. <laughs> You kind of keep fit and particularly when you've got so many commitments in your schedule well i take my husband's herbs <laughs> he has dietary supplements he brings from the amazon rainforest and that's what i take and i exercise i was in the gym early this morning a little bit but... like a little bit like in the physical group. <laughs> when i did the physical clip way back then I was mortified I said oh this song's coming out and it's too risque can you imagine I was worried about it we've got to do something to counteract the riskiness let's do an exercise video and it made it even <laughs> crazier so you, you considered that song to be risque and in the 80s it was mm. now it isn't but in its day yeah. in its day it was it's great to see it turning up in glee yes they took the physical set from the video that we did in the 80s and rebuilt it. So when I walked on, it was like deja vu. It was really bizarre. It really was bizarre. I go, where am I? You actually had to pull quite a few extraordinary moves as well. It was oh, all very choreographed. Extraordinary. Yeah. Yeah, very extraordinary. <laughs> You're bench pressed by a bunch of very oh, no. hot uh, younger yeah. gentlemen. That must yes. have been tough. It, it was tough. <laughs> but someone had to do it. Let me hear your body talk. Ryan Murphy, who's the creator of the show, told me that he learnt to sing from my music. So he wanted to know if, if I'd play myself, but a different version, like a diva-ish version. So that's what I did, and it was really funny. Hello, sir. It's Olivia Newton-John. Nice try, and that's a ridiculous accent. <laughs> <laughs> you can catch... Uh, well, you don't have to wait too long to catch Olivia Newton-John tonight on...